the past. Um, first of all, you might be able to tell from my general demeanor that I'm not feeling great today. I have a cold. Um, second, I don't know when this video is going out, but I'm filming it in December. Um, it is December 13th, so pre-Christmas. Um, and I am here in the Michaels parking lot. Um, I need to get some tins for cookies that I'm going to be baking this weekend. Um, and while I was here, I thought I would pull up my phone and do a little bit of a shopping vlog because uh, Marushka, my summer touch herself, requested um, a video like this basically just to show what's available in uh, the Michaels stores as far as planning supplies. Um, and since I'm here, I'm actually going to be looking at Happy Planners. Um, just yesterday morning while I was half awake uh, rocking the baby, I kind of had this crazy thought that I think I'm going to try using a Happy Planner Mini in the new year for my um, content planning and creation and notes and, and project pages. Um, I'm definitely going to be doing another full video about that, flip throughs of that setup once it's done, and a discussion of why I'm thinking that that's a good idea. Um, I don't know at this point whether that's before or after this video is coming out, but here we are today just to take a look at what's available in the Michaels store. So like I said, it's December. There's always sales going on. There's sales going on all the time anyway. Um, my understanding is that all of the planner supplies are 40% off today. Um, and it's called like a door buster, which I think means that it's not eligible for coupons. I'll try anyway. Um, always make sure to go to your phone. Um, bring your phone, or you could print it out, but bring your phone, go to michaels.com slash coupons, and that will um, show you all the coupons that are available, and then they can scan those at checkout. So I, I think I saw that there's one that's good for 20% off all your whole, I, the whole purchase, um, and then one that's 40% off a non-sale item, which I don't think I'm gonna find any of those today. So let's just go ahead and take a look at what is in stock today. honestly really annoying. It's hard to tell what these all are. And it says here, right in the corner, budget. I didn't see that at first. I'm sitting here trying to figure out what these spreads look like. You can kind of see one of them in the back here. But you can't even, like I can tell that, I can, okay it says hustle now play later. I like that cover but that's a budget planner. This one here looks like it's a normal planner but like, what does the cover say? I don't know. It's like, And you can't tell what's inside because of this packaging, and that's super annoying. This is why people make flip throughs. A lot of these keep saying planner babe on them. Like, I'm nobody's babe. Anyway. There's one up here that says happy notes, and I think this might be what I want. I think it just has a lot of blank paper in it.
we made it. None of those things were coupon eligible. It's kind of hard to complain what kind of is you can usually get like a really great deal if something's not on sale. Um, you know, you can get that 40% off pretty much anything any week of the year. Um, but then they always do these things to squirrel out of being able to use coupons because it's like 40% off a, a regular priced item, but everything in the store is 30% off. So what do you do? Or in this case, these things were on sale for like 50% off, but then not coupon eligible for anything. So whatever. But I got these tins. These are always great for um, giving away cookies as gifts and stuff. So I'm making snickerdoodles for some of the people in our life. Um, and so I got some of these. And then I hope that uh, you're able to get a good view of everything that's inside the store. They're... Um, it feels like a lot until you start to look at it. You know, it always feels like, ooh, it's this wonderland of planner supplies. I think if um, your style matches what they sell there, and they sell a lot of things that are the same style. So they're saying, like, everything said planner babe on it. I am no one's babe. Like, I don't like that word. It just seems weird to me. Um, so, you know, it's like it doesn't really apply to me. And so I find myself picking through stuff a lot of times when I'm at Walmart. I'm sorry, at Michael's Walmart too. Um, Joann's as well. I don't usually buy a lot of planner supplies at craft stores. When I do, it's more likely to just be scrapbook paper and then I make something myself with my laminator or whatever. Um, and then if I want something specific, I'll buy it online. Um, so Joann's is pretty much the same. I generally tend to prefer Joann's for one reason. Um, they seem to not, uh, the way that Michael's sort of caters to the lowest common denominator. Um, they sell a lot of things that are like, you know, craft kits and stuff. I think Michael's probably is better for fine art, but Joann's is definitely better for sewing because they're the only ones that sell fabric. So that's where I tend to go. I also find that, um, at least back when I was really getting into cross stitch, Joann's had better prices for embroidery floss. It was like 35 cents instead of 40 cents. Um, anyway. Um, I also just mostly prefer the Joann's because they uh, have a more accessible parking lot and it's literally across the street. But today I was here for those tins, so that's why I chose Michael's today. Um, anyway, as you saw, I did end up picking up this Happy Notes in the mini size. And I'm going to be trying this out and definitely reporting back once it's set up. Um, so yeah, I think I was halfway through saying that like, if your style matches what like they have a lot of happy planners they have a lot of um is it recollections i don't know the um they sell I, I showed them in there the um personal size ring planners my mom has one that she got from there um and so there's things that match that and then there's things that match the mambi stuff and then they i showed also they have some traveler's notebooks those are also i think no, I think those are standard sized uh, traveler's notebooks and they're like faux leather. Um, so none of those match anything that I really have right now. They don't have anything in pocket size. And so I find myself just kind of picking and choosing and digging around. Love their washi tape selection. Um, but it's basically, there's like two aisles there plus the, um, the scrapbook paper is its own aisle uh, that I shop in for, for planner supplies. So showed you those. Hope that gave you a good idea. Comment below if you have questions. Um, and yeah, thank you for coming out in public with me. I don't do this a lot because I don't really like lugging my camera out in public and looking like a fool. So I do it for you. Love you, Marushka. Love the rest of you. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. I post videos twice a week and I'll see you in the next one whenever that is because I don't know when this is going out. Bye from the past. <laughs>